22-year-old Juan Manuel Perez was diagnosed with pneumonia two weeks ago. She says he has weak lungs and we have to be very careful with him. He stayed in the hospital for a few days, but doctors didn't want him returning to his home. He needs to be in a clean room all to himself. The Perez family was living in this small trailer in a Penitas Colonia, sharing beds and sleeping on the floor. Since it's such a small trailer, the conditions weren't good for his health. When Buckner International, a Christian ministry, found out about this family struggle, they wanted to help. They partnered up with the Texas and Illinois Women's Missionary Union and built this new home so that little Juan Manuel could sleep easy. We picked them and the homeowner Juan has been with us every step of the build. He's dug ditches with the women, he's, he's, um, he's done everything with us and we're just so delighted that they will have a new place that they can move into next week. He says, I'm just so emotional right now. Words can't describe how I feel. 19 volunteers, 17 of them women, between the ages of 43 and 74 arrived Sunday and built the home in no time. By next week, they expect to be finished. She says this is a dream come true for us. San Juana de la Rosa was overcome by emotion when the volunteers gave them the keys to their new home. She says her family will never forget this group of women who built their home with such love. In Hidalgo County, Erica Flores, Action for News.